James Earl Carter Jr., born October 1, 1924, is an American politician and humanitarian who served as the 39th President of the United States from 1977 to 1981. A member of the Democratic Party, he was the 76th Governor of Georgia from 1971 to 1975 and a Georgia State Senator from 1963 to 1967. At age 100, Carter is the oldest living former U.S. president and the longest lived president in U.S. history. Carter was born and raised in Plains, Georgia. He graduated from the U.S. Naval Academy in 1946 and joined the U.S. Navy Submarine Service. Carter returned home after his military service and revived his family's peanut growing business. Opposing racial segregation, Carter supported the growing civil rights movement and became an activist within the Democratic Party. He served in the Georgia State Senate from 1963 to 1967 and then as governor of Georgia from 1971 to 1975. As a dark horse candidate not well known outside Georgia, Carter won the Democratic nomination and narrowly defeated the incumbent Republican Party President Gerald Ford in the 1976 presidential election. Carter pardoned all Vietnam War draft evaders on his second day in office. He created a national energy policy that included conservation, price control, and new technology. Carter successfully pursued the Camp David Accords, the Panama Canal Treaties, and the second round of strategic arms limitation talks. He also confronted stagflation. His administration established the U.S. Department of Energy and the Department of Education. After leaving the presidency, Carter established the Carter Center in Atlanta, Georgia to promote and expand human rights. In 2002, he received a Nobel Peace Prize for related work. He traveled extensively to conduct peace negotiations, monitor elections, and further the eradication of infectious diseases. Carter is a key figure in the nonprofit housing organization Habitat for Humanity. He has also written numerous books, ranging from political memoirs to poetry, while continuing to comment on global affairs, including two books on the Israeli-Palestinian conflict, in which Carter criticizes Israel's treatment of Palestinians as apartheid. Jimmy Carter and Rosalind Smith Carter were married for 77 years until her death in 2023. They had four children together. Carter said, Rosalind was my equal partner in everything I ever accomplished. She gave me wise guidance and encouragement when I needed it. As long as Rosalind was in the world, I always knew somebody loved and supported me.